So we've got a, a video on YouTube with setting up the timestamp on the bullet camera. Uh, but Martin Bulmer emailed me in and making me aware of a comment from an agent. Let me go and find it. An agent, Clutton, um, who's put this coding on. So I looked into this and this is really interesting. So thank you, agent, for putting this on because... Um, using if you do this it can save yourself a lot of time and it's super simple to change the date and time on your bullet cam let me show you so what i'm going to do now is copy the code like that copy that go back into my SD card. I'm going to right click and put new and I'm going to be there's going to be a time a, a new text so a document there. I'm going to paste like this. So all of that code was uh, that was on there is now in here and I'm going to save as I'm going to call it actually cam and I'm going to save it as it doesn't give me an option there but I'm going to save it as a dot bat see if it goes if that works so dot bat I'm going to save I'm going to close and now we have the dot bat there file let me just delete this one because we don't need that one there. And now when I double click this file, it should update that time date file. So let me try. So I've double clicked. That should all be good. And let's try that in the camera now. So thank you, Martin Bulmer, who made me aware of that uh, on that post. And um, and thank you, Adrian Clutton, who put that up there. Um, just a disclaimer, it works with Windows 10, should work with the with other Windows. Not sure if it will work with Macs and uh, it's not our coding, but it seems to work perfect. So, um, yeah, it looks a, a nice little bit of easy way of setting your date and timestamp so uh, and it works well for us